is still fairly broken. And by broken, I mean expensive and time consuming. So really at the highest level, Iris is, is aiming to improve design efficiency and save cost. Where we're going with that first is through creating a very intuitive, useful platform for 3D files into virtual reality. Architects build physical models like cardboard or chipboard or foam core models to show clients sort of an idea of what they're getting sort of true to scale. When you're like literally holding a chipboard model, holding it up and looking through it, you're trying to place yourself in that space and you get a physical sense of how that feels. Um, virtual reality also does that. So the broad goal for the product is to automate the process of taking a model and transform that into a realistic uh, three-dimensional experience that you can actually walk through. So, for example, architects model buildings in SketchUp or Revit without learning another software suite or uh, paying somebody else to build out a virtual reality walkthrough for them. It would be great if they could take that native file, drag and drop it into some very simple application, and then be able to put on the headset and walk through a realistic representation of that model. So we want our software to be ubiquitously used. We want everyone to use it that's touching 3D. Um, but those are very different industries in a sense. And so we're going to have a tiered software where at the lowest tier, it's going to be free. Um, and it's going to be pretty much just a viewer. And then our highest tier is going to be focused around BIM, which is building information modeling. For the engineers and for a, a group of professionals that are working collaboratively on a project, a suite of tools to allow them to collaborate on a project in real time, in virtual reality, record everyone's feedback that's together in the space. Those are, those are really big features that I think are going to impact the industry. I think the professional applications related to VR will guarantee the success of that entire platform where gamers will buy Oculus Rift and use it um, within their games. But I think that sort of longer term, the professional applications sort of show defensibility of the entire technology. Um, and I'm happy that Iris can be sort of at the forefront of professional applications. We really are one of the first companies building out a professional tool set um, for the Oculus Rift and virtual reality.